read your Bible and watch men Joshua tells the son stand still that one is not a law because nobody has replicated it that one oh, is not a law how do you look at the son and tell it to stand still Moses looks, listen, listen. We brag and say we're in the New Testament, yet we don't come close to what this man did. Listen, I'm telling you, my spirit is fired up right now. A man, an ordinary man, leading 2.5 million people, he stands at the Red Sea, a stammerer, and he holds his stick and drops it on that water. And it's not a parable, it parted heater and teeter. Hear me, your Bible talks about a man called Noah who did not study architecture, yet he built an ark. It was not a parable. Have you built any structure that can host all the animals in the world? And that, listen, the best of the structures in the world have been victims of tsunamis, have been victims of all kinds of tornadoes and volcanoes. But that which Noah built, no pillar to the ground, standing on water, yet it did not sink. What technology did he deploy? Listen, many of us here are science-based. Prove to me that you can build an ark of gopher wood with a lot of space inside are we together and put all the animals in the wall that weight must make it sink are we together all the animals in the world and then the heavens give rain and the earth also gives rain and yet it does not capsize it does not turn around come on There are realms beyond science. There are realms beyond physics. There are realms that only intimacy can take you there. Please believe us, hear me. I speak to an intellectual generation. I respect your intellect. But there are realms and virgin dimensions in the spirit that it takes hunger and a press that men can access power Power that science cannot explain. There are dimensions of grace. I'm telling you there is a generation. Every generation will not fail. I assure you there is a generation that will get it. There is a generation that will get it. There is a generation that will get it. It is a hunger in the heart of God. Every generation will not miss it. I have watched the videos of God's generals by the privilege of God's grace. I have heard of the things that they did. I have read about the church in Nigeria, the mighty men and women who God used and we salute everything they have done. But like every generation, we also saw their limitations. I'm telling you there is a generation that will demonstrate God to the earth, that will dumbfound principalities and powers living walking miracles living walking miracles living walking miracles there are thrones there are kingdoms 